Hello there guys and welcome to a video where I'm a little bit nervous. This reminds me of the day when I went to go get Joffrey from Toys R Us where I had to wake up really early just to get him in the stores. This is kind of the same situation. Today is the day that the Emerald City Comic Con uh, exclusive Funko Pops are released. Hot Topic, GameStop, Barnes & Noble, the Funko Shop, you know, the whole shablam. However, out of all of these, with a, a couple of them that I'm okay with, maybe I'll get, maybe not, I don't know. The one I really want is Cagney Carnation from Cuphead. He's one of my favorite bosses in the game, particularly due to his amazing dance animation right here. And he's exclusive to GameStop, which is literally 14 minutes away from my house. However, I don't really feel comfortable walking around this uh, neighborhood because of reasons. So right now, I'm waiting for my dad to get home from work so that we can go together and we can finally pick him up. However, we keep thinking that he may or may not still be available due to flippers, people who actually do want him. I have a whole bunch of other GameStops I can go try if the one next to my house happens to be sold out. So... Let's see what happens. I'm going to try to record most of it, but obviously I don't think I'll feel comfortable recording in-store. Who knows? Let's see what happens. But, uh, yeah, I'll catch you guys up in a bit in about five seconds. So, one, two, three, four, five, go! Oh, Funko, why do you do this to me? Yeah, today has been hectic, as expected. Um, and the Emerald City Comic Con has started today in Washington. That also means that the pops are live everywhere. Green Chrome Batman. That thing sold out in one minute. I was actually, yeah, I actually visited the website before it happened. Yeah. It was so slow because all the internet traffic yeah. just piled in. My God, that would have been absolutely hell for anyone. I mean, you know, congrats to anyone who actually managed to get a copy, but that sounds like absolute hell to go through. Uh, same goes for the Bigfoot and the other uh, items as well. I, I mean, maybe a couple of them are still, still available, but yeah. I doubt it. Alright guys, so we just left GameStop. As I expected, they sold out. The bullcrap thing was that they sold out 10 minutes before I entered the store, which I seem is a little fishy, like really? <laughs> That's a little weird, but however, we did find one in Islandia that actually has it, so we're on our way there right now. Bruh! Alright guys, this is the GameStop that apparently has it. Let's go in and take a look. Alright guys, finally got the Cadney Carnation. This game stop was absolutely fantastic. They had everything we are looking for. And of course, a extra surprise, but I will reveal that when we get home. Alright, we're finally back home. Now we can take a look at Cagney Carnation. This is one of the bosses in Cuphead. In fact, one of the final bosses of World 1, if you choose to do it in that order. He is number 331 in the set, and he's an exclusive to this year's ECCC, which is Emerald City Comic Con in Washington. And they have a whole bunch of cool stuff, but this is the one I wanted the most. But anyway, let's take a look. Gorgeous! It's just simply marvelous. This is Cagney Carnation, as he appears in the game. Perfect. I love what Funko did here. He's really big. He's not really, you know, you can't really turn his head. He's all one solid piece, as some of these characters can be. They have his hands in that dance form, of course, because, like I said, that's like the best dance of all friggin' time. But I love how they molded him in that pose. It's just, it's fantastic. Definitely need this guy, because I'm a huge Cuphead fan. And I hope they make more of the bosses. And if they do, it's going to be a pretty expensive collection. Uh, but yeah, let's see where I'm going to put them. All right, here's my video game setup, as you can see, from the Monster Hunters at the top and the Cupheads in the front. I finally got Mugman, by the way. He finally came in the mail. Uh, this yellow Yoshi needs to go, though. There we go. All right, here we go. There we go. Now they're all together. Looks great. As a bonus, guys, we also got the Hulkbuster Funko Pop here, which is a new 6-inch from Avengers Infinity War. The game style we went to happened to have the whole set there, and this thing looks amazing. Uh, this is mostly for my father, though, since he's more into the stuff than I am, but really, really impressive. Alright, guys, that's gonna be it. Um, yeah, pretty successful. Um, I got a little bit worried, because after I left the first GameStop and I started calling all the others, none of them had it. Like, I called, like, five of them, and none of them had it, and I was like... Well, time to go for eBay and pay those flipper prices, but no. Uh, finally, I found one that actually had one left, and I was managed to get it. Thank God, because I did not want to spend 30 bucks. <laughs> but anyway, uh, thank you guys so much for watching, and as always, leave a like and comment if you enjoyed. I'm speaking way too fast. And I uh, hope you guys got all the exclusives you wanted. I know it's pretty tough this year since it's not that many, but it is what it is. 
All right, guys. See you another time.